At Millersville University, a student is developing a high-tech way to train eye surgeons. News 8's Lori Burkholder has that story. The temp zero and temp one are the, the point above them, the point above and below the toilet, the line I'm checking. Matt Harris is doing something that no other undergraduate student in the world is doing. A little overwhelming. I, mean, I never really imagined that I'd, I'd be working on this type of stuff. Matt Harris, a student at Millersville University, is spending his summer vacation developing a software program that's breaking ground in medical technology. We're trying to simulate cataract surgery. At this point, we're simulating the f one of the first important steps in the procedure. Dr. Joseph Sasani of Penn State Hershey Medical Center teamed up with Dr. Roger Webster of Millersville to create the software which will train doctors on a procedure used in eye surgery. And of course, we'll be able to simulate some of the difficulties that can occur in the procedure and teach them how to handle them at the same time in a simulated environment where they can rerun it and try it again if there's a problem. By using physics and computer simulation, Dr. Webster and Harris are making virtual surgery for the eye a reality, a feat that's anything but simple. I have a famous quote, it's that the hard part about inventing the future is that nobody's done it before. And it sounds stupid, but what it really means is we're doing something that nobody else has ever done. You're going to be the doctor today. You're going to practice cataract surgery. The simulator gives doctors an opportunity to get used to the equipment while performing the delicate surgery. It's easier to make mistakes and learn here than in an actual operating room. Do you have it? Do I have yeah, it? Yeah, no, no, you don't have it. Boy. One more time. It isn't easy. No, it's not. Is it? Yeah, I think Millersville is doing some really great things, uh, especially in computer science. We have a lot of expertise. We have really, really good students uh, who are really the key to making this all happen. So he has to coordinate his hands and his feet to get everything in balance. In Millersville, Lancaster County, Lori Burkholder, News 8. Now, development of the software program should be finished by the fall. As for Matt, he got an A for his research work and is preparing for his senior year of college. Hmm, Surprise.